Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you how and why you might want to be using the URL parameters in your text and image templates on Zazzle. So let's dive into it. I have this very, very bare bones, pretty ugly um, birthday invitation. We just need to add the templates in. So we're going into the design tool and really simple. We're going to add in the text templates the name. We'll skip the age for this for the example. I have something I want to show you. So when where oh I will go do the name now. Uh, or the age I mean sorry. Age and then RSVP. So now we did it out of order and you can see the URL parameters. Parameters. This one it says text one, text four, text two, text three, text five. So that's actually the order that they're gonna show up on the product page. So it's name, when, where, age, RSVP. But we want it to show up in the proper order that it's showing up on the product because that's what's going to be best for customers, right? So let's go back into the design tool and we're going to fix it. So we want 16 to be URL, the second thing that shows up on the product page. So we want it to be URL parameter two, but we already have a URL parameter two. So let's look at what's going to happen when I change it. If I go to done, it's showing as age for UL, URL parameter two, but it's still showing the when. So it's kind of messed up. You change one of these. Okay, so now it's gonna change both of those. So we don't want that. Okay. So the best way to fix that is to uncheck the template um, let's fix this 16 and then we'll go to when and we want it to be number three but I think this one's number three this is number five okay so first we're going to switch this one to four and then we'll switch this one to three and then we can now make this one a template and make it number two oops and it should be all fixed. Name, age, oh, we gotta fix this. When. All right, so we got name, age, when, where, RSVP. So that's the main reason to be using the URL parameters is to specify the order you want each template to show up in on the product page. There's another way that you can use it, another uh, use case for the URL parameters. And it's if you want to have like multiple of the same um, template. So for example, on the back, we are going to add Angie's name. And then we can add her name again and add it again. Okay, let's just pretend it was like looking good and we covered the back of the card with her name. And we want all of them to be like to change simultaneously. So for example, We have so they're all going to be different uh, URL parameters which means they're all going to show up separately on the product page so you'd have to change each name individually so that's where you would want to make them all the you the same that one's six six and then we'll put back So 
now we've got the back of the card. Personalize it. It shows up once at the back. And we can change it to whatever we want. Perfect. And they all change together. But you definitely want to double check when you make templates. Double check them that they're working properly the way that you want them to. So that is it, my friends. If you learned something here today, please give the video a like and be sure to subscribe for more Sazzle tips. Bye.